What up, everybody? Jared here. Thanks again for tuning in to another episode, episode 5 to be exact, of Bedlam Crown TV. Today we're going to be talking about something kind of special in my opinion because it was recommended to me by my friend Bobby. So this one's for you, Big B. Today we're going to be talking about Rings of Saturn. And the song is called Inadequate. And what I haven't heard a single lick of these guys before. And what kind of drew me to this particular video clip that I saw when I was going through YouTube looking for the right song that I wanted to do. Basically, I saw alien ships and an alien head, and I was sold. That's all I needed, because I love all that kind of stuff. So, here we go with Rings of Saturn. I've looked them up on Wikipedia just to get some very, very basic information. Uh, I don't really care about genre and what they're classified as, but if you are wondering, it says it's Deathcore. Um, so, already I'm into it, and I haven't even heard a single tone yet. Uh, they are from the Bay Area, so somewhere in the San Francisco Bay Area. They've been around since 2009, and from what I was reading, they have started in high school, and they've been buddies ever since. I don't think there's been any personnel changes. It's been the four of them pretty steadily since then. Um, you've got band members Lucas Mann, Ian Bearer, Joel Omans, and Mike Pluto. I, let me skip down here. They got some really killer uh, album title names. The most recent, I want to say it's called Gidim. G-I-D-I-M, I think is how you say that. Not sure what it means, but sounds really cool. And they've got a few other ones. Uh, Ultu Ula. Ultu Ula, 2017. If I'm saying this wrong, Rings of Saturn, I apologize. But uh, I'm assuming it's going to be badass. Uh, in 2014, they put out Lugal Kien. In 2012, they put out an album called Dinger or Dinger. <laughs> and then in 2010, they put out Embryonic Anomaly. So all these titles with a song called Inadequate with alien themes and stuff, I'm pretty sure I'm in. So let's give it a whirl without any further ado. Thanks again for stopping in and checking out my channel. I appreciate you building a little bit of traction here. So let's jump right into this video. Here is Rings of Saturn with Inadequate. I was not expecting flamenco sounding guitars like a Mexican style guitar. So far, so good. Some piano. Got our alien. Killer graphics. I have a feeling it's not going to stay like this. Considering it started out the way it did to where it is now, that's fucking sick. I love it when a band is unique enough to where when you think you should dip in for your head nod on a drum beat, that it doesn't happen, something else happens, and then it goes a different way. It kind of keeps you off, but still in a pace of a killer song. I love that. This is Did you hear that? And then we got the mothership. This is sick. They're all just chilling on a beautiful day in the Bay Area. Just playing in the backyard, you know, for their homies. 
and then all of a sudden the alien ships come in. Yeah. Bobby. These graphics are amazing. <laughs> Did you hear right then? You will suffer. Dude, that was amazing. Graphically, musically, every time I thought something was going to go a certain way, it didn't. I love it when a band can keep you guessing like that. They were tight musicians. They knew what they were doing. They made it look effortless and easy. They freaking pounded it. It was heavy as hell. It was beautiful. In places, it had the piano, it had the strings, it had that kind of acoustic Hispanic guitar in there for a minute, it felt like. That was good, good shit. I'm definitely going to do a deeper vibe, uh, excuse me, a deeper dive into Rings of Saturn. So, Bobby, killer recommendation, brother. Thank you so much. Appreciate everybody checking in with me. This was episode 5 of Bedlam Crown TV. Going to be posting somewhat regularly, so... Feel free to check in on me anytime you like. I enjoy doing this. I'm so just hanging out in my music room. Uh, my friend and I, Bobby, are going to be putting some music out for the world here hopefully soon this year. Uh, 2020 and 2021 have kind of been weird with the political bullshit and the pandemic and all that. But uh, things are going to start turning around. I promise you that. So keep listening to music. Music will never let you down. So always be faithful to it, and it will always be there for you, all right? Appreciate you. Let me get out of here in my typical don't-know-what-I'm-doing fashion. Anyway, this was Episode 5 of Bedlam Crown TV. <laughs>